My name is Rhapsody, his name is Orbital Potato, and welcome back to Northgard. Welcome back. Welcome back. Mm -hmm. well, how is your empire going? You have a remarkable number of warboys, and I don't like it. Uh, yeah, no, I'm sending him straight at you for the domination victory I can't achieve. <laughs> well, yeah, but you can, like, completely dominate the land. That is something that you can do. Mm, I think you think more of me than I think of me. I think a lot of you. Yeah. That's that's for sure. And I know that you're playing the long game. Uh, so... See, I, I, th I think you're ascribing... Uh... Ascribing a certain skill to me that I may not necessarily actually have. Right, let's. I'm trying I to micro my roles around think. so that I, you know, have certain people doing certain things at certain times so that I don't hit certain caps. Gonna be as vague as uh -huh. possible, I guess. Oh, man, I'm running Population out of fucking caps. money as well. That's a ridiculous thing. Or a dinky donk thing. Indeed exactly. it is. Exactly. Yeah, okay. You go there. Oh, fuck me, I'm losing a lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. I'm losing a lot of food. A lot, a lot of food right now. Fucking Altar of Kings turned out not to be that worthwhile. Not gonna lie. It was... Yeah. Meh in the extreme, actually. Mm hmm So, there you go. Um, um... Something to ponder. Eh, I'm kind of glad to hear it, but I'm also kind of sad to hear it. How much yeah, food have you got banked up, just out of curiosity? I'm about to start having buildings burn because I don't have enough to repair them. Um... Oh... How much food shit. do I have stocked up? Two. Yeah. Wow, okay. So I'm about to have people start uh, starving as well. <laughs> oh boy. That's a little less than ideal. Mm, yeah, no, I, I, well, I wasn't I wasn't thinking, mm, actually, you know what would be a really good idea right now? I just need some people to start starving. Look, like sarcasm? Unnecessary. Yep. Oh, sorry. I mean... Okay, so now I'm on positive, <laughs> positive 12. Sorry, I didn't know sarcasm was unnecessary. If you told me earlier... Uh, yeah, thank God. Um, okay, positive 12. Okay, I'm just I'm just thinking, because I want this lore victory, mm -hmm. and therefore... I want food. So we're, we're not allowed to attack each other. Like, we're not, we're not allowed to attack each other at all, right? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I guess, to me, that just makes sense. Yeah, no, I agree. I agree. I agree. But, like... I mean, I... Yeah, okay. <laughs> I mean, I could attack you, I think, is what was about to No, 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 I'm not, no. I'm not saying that. It's more just around the specific rules of if I was to take this province with the stone circle in, if I've got my troops in here, then mm -hmm. you're not going like, to attack it. No. That's that's more okay. Yeah, no, I, I, I mean, look, the map is split almost perfectly 50-50, so works out quite well, I guess, right? Mm-hmm. So we've got that going for us, which is nice. Uh, I keep losing population. These fights are fucking keep, hamming me. I keep on losing all of my happiness, and I don't understand why it's happening. I keep on losing myself in your eyes. Yeah, take that. I suppose the yeah the face reveal will be out uh, by then I suppose so oh, whoever exactly. anyone can get lost in my eyes there you go <laughs> just head over to orbital <laughs> orbital.com <laughs> yeah orbitalpotato.com actually steady on oh sorry orbitalpotato.com then you can find uh, you know there multiple different ways to contact him and spam either no train challenge next or ten <laughs> <laughs> did wait what. You didn't actually Did I you spam no train challenge at over to potato.com as well. I've I have spammed so many things of yours with that. <laughs> I said, <laughs> can I say I sent one directly to your Facebook as well? <laughs> yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> that was good. I like that one. <laughs> uh.
That was... <laughs> I was just like, what different yeah. methods could I use to contact you with, that would get most under your skin? Shit, that'll yeah. do it. We, 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 should pro we should probably talk about this and what this actually is, because this is the second time this has happened. Mm -hmm. So, the first time was, is that I tweeted out something like, oh, some guy has left uh, five comments on the YouTube video saying, no train challenge next? I think yeah. it was on like a train fever video? Yes. I think? It's like, why would, okay, well, first off, before we go into details, why would you ever do that? Like, that's the least fun way of playing a game called Train Fever. <laughs> like, why would you have, it's like, just, it's, now we're just playing Fever. <laughs> exactly, exactly. It would just be completely horrendous. Mm -hmm. And anyway, um, how did how did you respond to that? You, you tell the story. You tell uh, the story. So you told me how frustrating it was. Uh, and uh, hyperbole may be being used. Uh, but so what I decided is because it frustrated him, that I would find every single different method of contact available, uh, including, what was it at the time? Different emails that you were running, YouTube messages, face uh, not Facebook messages yep. at the time, Twitch, Twitch. Twitter, Twitch DM, messages. direct Twitter, just every single uh -huh. different method uh -huh. to piss you off. Um, mm -hmm. And then you released an episode that was just labeled 10. <laughs> just because, <laughs> yeah. oh yeah. <laughs> YouTube uploader fucked up. Yeah. Did it again. Yep. And except you did it with way more. You did it way more this time, including yeah, way more Facebook reach. I've I've done it to so many different Reddit. ways that I. Yeah. Well done. Uh, I've done it to so many yeah. different ways that I feel like you're still gonna be discovering them in uh, like maybe a year's time. We'll be recording something and you'll go. Yeah. I found another one, by the way. You stupid piece of yeah. shit. And I'll be like, yeah. <laughs> it was comprehensive. Ah, yeah. oh, that's no. That's good. That's good fun. I, I do enjoy. I do enjoy that. <laughs> um, also, you're quite close to a fame victory, actually. Mm, I don't know You've if got the turf. I don't know if anyone's uh, doing that at all. <laughs> I mean, it's got to be. It's got to be. Abrupt ending of laughter. <laughs> <laughs> Abrupt ending of laughter, indeed. Um, you know what I can't have? I can't have more than four uh, lore masters active, so I need to build an actual stone, which is mm -hmm. really shitty, and it feels really bad, man. Oh! Um, so here's a thing that I just learned, uh, that actually has... It, I now can't win. Why? So, we have no combat. Yeah. Um, I... can control at maximum 11 spaces. Why? There is, because uh, to take any more spaces would be killing you. So, I now can't no. win. What are you talking about? No, wait, how many spaces have you got controlled right now? Ten. Yeah, so there's one right here, the dracker, right? The dragger? And then there's, yeah, the dragger. And then there's another one that's like behind your silos in the very corner. Of behind my side. Oh, I didn't even fucking see that place. No, my dude started scouting it, and then I thought, uh, yeah, no. So, so there's definitely a place there. So you can you can get twelve easily, yeah, and I'll right. let you have this tracker one because it seems it's fair. That's, like, that's... Is, uh, you don't have to make it easy on me. I mean, yeah, but why not? Like it's it doesn't benefit me anyway. So I, sh I shouldn't have played worthless. my hand out. I I knew you were getting a fame thing. So I mean, mm, I don't know. I've been so sneaky about it. It's not like you can click a button; <laughs> it tells you what I'm doing. <laughs> Oh wait, hang on, can you? <laughs> Shit, someone should have told me. Oh goodness. Alright, um It's just yeah, so you're you're way closer than I am, holy shit. It's just a matter of amassing fame. Oh, fuck me. Mm-hmm. We need to up our game, boys. Uh, okay, villager. I might have left it a smidgel widgel too late. A whole smidgel widgel too late? Yeah, a whole Say it ain't so. Yeah, I know. I I know it. Oh, it's the big bad boys. You managed to defend them? 
against them. Oh, they might they might decolonize. Mm. Okay, here's a question. What if what if someone is decolonized? Like what if the Dracker decolonizes one of your places like they very well might do? <laughs> Is it fair oh. game then? Also, you, what are you talking I about? Mean, you can you totally can't... colonize the wyvern area. Uh, you can't get to that Draca uh, decolonizing place right now. What? Um, what, the Draga? Oh shit, they're trying... What? They're trying to decolonize me from there? Yeah. Rude. Um, what I was going to say is that you can totally control the wyvern area. Uh, I mean... I could force you to do that, actually, by taking out this forest right here. Which would delay your win condition, which I think is actually going to be my strat. It's got to be my strat. I mean, I've got no other strat to win. So that means mm -hmm. you have to conquer the wyvern. Mm. Whoa, we're fighting? Sorry? What? Oh, do you own this You're, place? We're fighting? Yeah, I've got do, my troops do you, here. Do you, own this? Fight. do you own this place? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> now you're changing the rules? Changing the rules? All right. All right. No, it's like... decolonization. That's that. <laughs> Oh, I don't know about that. That is that is sneaky as fuck, dude. All right. All right. I think that might be considered changing the rules. Right, fine. I mean, the, I will mention uh, conquering the wyvern is going to be practically impossible, but it will it will forestall. So sure. I mean, it's the only it's the only play I have to like stop you from winning. It's the only thing that I have because I'm still so unbelievably far off a victory like even a moderate victory you're 90 percent of the way to towards yours whereas i'm like i've got a shit ton more sciencing to do mm -hmm. i should have done so, this just taken that place uh yeah. all right wyvern 100 resistance 40 attack power it attacks for uh almost the entire health of a warrior on uh aoe so it's gonna be rough. Shield boys. Shield boys. Yeah, no, but it does AoE, so even if it hits shield boys, it hits everyone else point. as well. That's a good point. Mm. That's a good point. For the first time ever, I have built these uh, carved stones, and I hated building them. They're dumb as fuck. They... I don't even know how much they get me, but it's fucking nothing in comparison to what I deserve from them. Like, they cost 15 stone, for God's sake, and they give you almost zero reward back? Like, what is that? What is that? Fucking extortion also, is what it is. It is. It's daylight robbery. It is daylight robbery. Also, on top of that, like, if you can build a lower stone out of regular stone, then surely, like, like... Surely you can just, like, I don't know, pulverize stone and, I don't know, make it into, like, some fine powder and then, like, I don't know, make it into a cake or something. Surely there's a better way to extract lore from the very stone itself rather mm -hmm. than building it back up to something and then, like, I don't know, humming at it or whatever. Yeah. Why don't you whatever crack it open do. and discover some fucking fossils, you pieces of shit Vikings? I was going to say cocaine, but... Uh, wow, if I mean, you can that... find cocaine in the... I mean, crack rock, okay, I understand, but... Aye, 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 aye. This is... This is... This is I mean, we can... If, if, it, if it turns out that just, you know, killing the wyvern is wholly impossible, we can change the rules to make attacking legit. Good lord, no. You're, you're too much of a, a fair player. I mean, I, I didn't, uh, I, I didn't try and take the victory immediately with the one space over there. I shouldn't do it past. I've got to make sure there is absolutely nothing because if if I had taken that place and then just left the one in the back row for me to take later, I'd be done. Uh huh. Yeah. 
That's true. That is true. You're not wrong. Oh, God. So many fucking carved stone pieces of shits around here. I've got so many in my territory, dude. And I fucking hate them all. Oh, my God. There you go. Go do this. Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay, interesting. What's your pulp at? Uh, 39. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Fuck me. I'm, I'm at 30. Uh-huh. I, I have lost Fuck a lot of people me. in fights as well, so I, I've... Like, I have three skulls fully stacked, and one of them leveled. Uh-huh. Uh like, I was trying to go super happiness to try and immediately turn that into people that I turned into more resources, right? So that's why I was running low, low on resources for the longest time because I had a lot of people just constantly making happiness to make more people to make my mm -hmm. resources. Yeah. Yeah. Have you, have you bamboozled me? Is there like another area that you secretly control that I'm... No. That you secretly can control? No, I'm standing, I'm standing here outside the Wyvern's Den uh, asking it to love me. With a warboy, what what is your tech looking like? Do you have warboy tech, like war tech? No, no. Of course, I've got every other tech. <laughs> of course, yes. Yeah. Of course. So this is this is gonna be a long journey. Uh, your your law will win out in time. You know what I'm thinking that I might actually do? What's that? I might actually try and go for a fame victory. Uh, not a not a fame victory. The other one. What's the other? Trade. Trade victory. I'm thinking... I might actually be able to win. Because I'm already half the way there. I've already made four grand. Mm -hmm. Which is quite nice. I've got a thousand crowns in stock. So I only need another five grand. But all you need to do is be that fucking wyvern piece of shit. I mean... And I have a funny feeling that you're going to do that way quicker than I am. I'm like loads of... Technologies off. I'm two technologies off. Fucking lore victory, and that's that's you know that's like two thousand five hundred lore to collect. Mm -hmm. That's realistically improbable that I even get close to succeeding. It's uh, it's gonna be a rough game. Oh, give me that much. It's definitely gonna be a rough game. I thought the fame rush was gonna work out for me. It was my idea from the start because the skulls also give you yeah. fame. So I was like fame That's good and then that runs back into itself giving me the happiness which runs back into itself you ah oh, it'll be, all be good but um yeah i get you i get you three of my buildings have been damaged where's the other one ditto fucking my oh, the thing of kings altar of kings hmm what even is the altar of kings even worth it what does it give me two food two eh, it's, it's all right it's actually pretty good all right, here. Give me your give me your opinion on lore victories because currently I'm I'm looking at this and I'm like this is just this is too fucking long. This is too right. long. So I, I've this has been nerfed recently, actually. Yeah, uh, I know. That's exactly why why it, I thought it's a bit shit. Exactly. Uh, so lore victory has been nerfed recently because if you can't, uh, just wait as I choose this guy. Um, it's it's more difficult to get sailors to give you all of your lore. Mhm. Mm okay. Sorry, I'm I'm trying to I'm trying to juggle so many different things right now. Are you attacking? The war boy, the uh, the boy? I mean, I fucking have to. <laughs> I'm trying I'm trying my best. Yeah. Um it's gonna be you and you. Okay. You've got a lot of boys, so I've, like I've got I've got a I've got a couple of boys. You're not wrong. I've got some good good sweet boys over there. They're gonna be helping me out. <laughs> Question is, can you do it in a one or though? Like that's that's what I want to know. I'm not sure. God, I have so many lore masters. I swear, I've had so many lore masters since the very beginning, and it just feels like they are pathetic. They are mm. utterly pathetic. Are, are you building like circle, uh, like the stones, and are you building them next to the? Uh, the other, what, what, what uh, the, like a circle of stones? I've got two circle of stones oh, in my shit. territory. No, right. If I had, 
No, I've only got... I've, well, you see, the only circle of stone that I actually have is all the way up next to you. Like, literally right next to you. And it's Garbo. I mean, no, I haven't built any any carved stones next to the circle of stones. But... Oh my god, you're easily gonna do it. Mm. Yeah, you're gonna do it. You're I don't think do easily. You're 100% gonna do it. No, you've got this, dude. You've got this. 100%. What do you mean you don't think easily? Uh, I'm losing you. Uh, there goes my fucking war chief. However... Yeah, you've got it. Nice. Well played. Thank you. GG. That was that was good, actually. That was good. And delayed the victory, I suppose, a little bit. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm... Oh, I'm never going wisdom victory again that was horseshit wisdom super slow Honestly. but building it next to so the oh we can even see here let's have a look at each other's strats all right so i hit my fourth expansion before you did and then i hit my we were quite similarly sized for a long time actually yeah then then here's where you really took out that would have gotten you a lot of happiness which i was replacing by picking up scolds we pretty the much did was, go half and half with the map as well. The the a major problem was is that I was too absorbed in our conversation to actually uh, play properly for that mid game, which yeah, was I, the most important part. I did that too. Yeah, that was really that was really bad, but that was really cool, like killing the wyvern. I mm. guess the strat is axe throwers, right? So that you're not affected by the AOE. Yeah, that that actually turned out to be it. I, I wasn't even like thinking severely about it at the time because I thought they stood closer to the target than they uh, they were standing to the wyvern. Um, I uh -huh. was mainly diversifying just because axe throwers do more damage but take less. That's quite cool, actually. That is quite cool. I also uh, ended up upgrading both of the different units so that they'd be stronger in battle by fifteen percent, and I picked up the sharp weapons i tried to get as many damage buffs as I, uh, I could without compromising my economy i i knew at a certain like before i said anything about not having 10 locations i knew i was gonna have enough fame it was literally just uh-huh uh -huh. yeah locations because yeah. i could put down the altar of kings as soon as i picked up one more stone yeah, uh, you know, I, I I literally didn't even build the Altar of Kings because I realized, I didn't even realize it was part of the fame victory. I mean, I knew, but I didn't, like, actively build it. I didn't know at the time that I built it. I was not paying attention to, I mean, to that. I just built it because it was something to build, I It's guess. worth noting, it's also two lore per second, and that's, it's what, good. that's exactly, what erudition yeah. gives you, right? The trait along the tree. That's also one yeah. less than you get from researching at a at a law stone it's one more it's twice as much as you get from a sailor exactly so it's it's a good it's a good building it's mm. a good building it is expensive though so i suppose it's 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 weighed up by that i feel but it gives you other stuff as well true i like feel like the law stuff. victory is pretty much conclusively locked behind never doing combat outside of just whatever expansion you need and then just always putting everyone doing all law like you need two people on every circle of stones you need to build a law stone directly next to it you need some sailors in the back although again that has been nerfed you need erudition up and you need to feast here's, a lot as well because it, it gives you more yeah i didn't uh, well i feasted a couple times but i didn't feast that much here's my issue like you were you were able pretty much to go at like full speed ahead fame victory from like one to zero or from like one to a hundred miles an hour in you know in a in a reasonable time though like i was i was far off i was like i was two and a half thousand wisdom off mm. i wasn't even close and i had a and i had exactly the same start i mean yeah sure i didn't min max to perfection and you know would have you know would have lost a lot of wisdom due to that but i wasn't even close mm. i that just i that's, mean mm. Yeah. I mean, there was definitely an element of me that was thinking fame is probably a faster victory. I thought trade would be the fastest victory, but I thought that fame would play into the way that I wanted to build my society, but I thought money uh -huh. would take away from the way I was building my society. Like, having to invest people into being <laughs> wow. merchants. Okay, so, no, but here's the thing, right? If I had to invest people into being merchants and sailors and things like that, they're only producing for me 
what they're directly producing, money, right? The Sailor is also giving you a little bit of lore, not enough, uh, and a little bit of fame. Right? I didn't think that was big. Yeah. But I thought yeah. if I went for the Skulls super early, I'd get happiness, and then the people that I got from that would give me all of the other resources, which is for building a yeah. decent society. I kind of that's I, I kind of think that's a, a big strat in Clan of the Goat, especially Clan of the Goat, Clan of the Stag, because you have the Skulls, which give you both fame and happiness, and then even further than that, uh, you can pick up money through them. They're really heavily incentivized. I went straight down to Glory of the Clan for plus twenty percent to all fame gains, fame gains as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and yeah, I yeah. held off mm -hmm. on upgrading any of my buildings until I did that because upgrading your buildings gives you twenty fame per. So I got four extra fame you out of that. You would have still like you would have still though like you would never have needed extra fame i don't think like you would have crushed over the frame the the, the fame threshold relatively easily even if, if you hadn't done that i don't think if i had the location that we uh that, that you took to deny if i had that location and then i went up and took the final location at the top i was just enough fame short that building the altar of the kings would have put me over the top I'm so fame rich in the end of this because I got 250 for killing the Wyvern yeah. and because I had to yeah, forestall course, yeah. for a while and my scolds were still building fame as well as building upgrades with giving fame and stuff. Yeah. Hmm. No, yeah, no, I'm not going to go for a wisdom victory ever again. The ironic thing is, right, is that my the trade victory, I've amassed, you know, just short of 5,000 5, crowns over mm -hmm. the entire playthrough. If I'd have actually tried to make crowns, I could have done a lot better than if I'd actively tried to make lore, mm -hmm. which is kind of weird. Like, <laughs> I feel that's a little bit like counterintuitive, but that is what it is, I suppose. Mm. GG, well played. That was a good game. Well played to you as well. I propose something. So okay. wisdom victories suck. They're incredibly slow and they're horrible and it's impossible to do them. 1v1 wisdom only? 1v1 <laughs> yeah yeah, sh yeah sure are we allowed to fight over the the circle of stones uh fuck because no because See, no here then that's the deal introduces... i think we should i think we should only be able to fight in the circle of stones like we got the wrestling ring a literal ring to wrestle in mm. Because okay. otherwise, right? Like whoever whoever controls the circle of stones, bada bim, bada boom, wins the video game, right? Well, I mean, there is a bunch of circle of stones on the map. But okay. Yeah, that's true. That's true. If there, if if a relic of the gods spawned, I I don't know what that is. What is so it? So the relic is of the god is it's uh you can it's it's a, it's a super powered circle of stones, right? Uh, a law stone placed next to it produces a hundred percent extra law, and you can. 100% extra lore is produced in the area, and you can put three lore masters on it. It's the big, uh, it's the big sword you actually currently see in the background on the Northguard screen. Oh, yes, that one, yes, of course. Mm, that would definitely be worth fighting over. I think that's something that we should decide in the next yeah. episode. I think it's you. Good idea. Ladies and gents, thank you very, very much for watching. My name, of course, has been Obito Potato. His name has been Rhapsody. Congratulations to you for your, uh, your fantastic victory. And we will see you next time. Bye. Adios.